The FDA is giving the green light for updated COVID vaccines from Pfizer and Moderna, which have been designed to better protect against the current circulating variants of the virus. The best plan going into this winter is for everyone to remain vigilant, to use the tools we have, vaccines, testing, treatment, against the illnesses responsible for the majority of fall and winter deaths and hospitalizations. The FDA says vaccinations continue to be the cornerstone of COVID-19 prevention and can help avoid the lingering symptoms of long COVID. The only way you get long COVID is by having COVID and vaccines can help prevent COVID. Updated shots are expected to be available at pharmacies and in doctor's offices in the coming days or weeks. The release coming just as kids are returning to school. The updated versions are approved for those over six months old, and medical professionals are encouraging anyone who's at high risk due to age or underlying health conditions to get vaccinated as soon as possible. Health experts recommend getting vaccinated sometime in September or October. It's gonna take a few weeks to get that protection, which may last for several months heading into what may be a winter surge. But vaccine records show many Americans have not been staying up to date on COVID shots. Last year, about 22 to 25 percent of people got the updated booster, which obviously takes down the total population immunity. So we should be focusing on education and awareness. The FDA says you are eligible for the updated vaccines at least two months after having your last shot. And if you recently tested positive for the virus, the CDC says you may want to wait three months after having COVID to get these updated vaccines. And for those who like to keep COVID rapid tests on hand for the third year in a row, the government is planning to relaunch its covidtest.gov website at the end of next month, once again offering free tests. Alex Stone, ABC News, Los Angeles.